Hello, I'm just going to do a video on how to test boiler uh, thermistors or temperature sensors for the boiler. These control the temperature of your hot water and the temperature of your central heating. These are basically a, a thermometer um, for your boiler and when your boiler gets to temperature, say you want your hot water at uh, 60 degrees, when this sensor senses that the, the hot water in your boiler has got to 60 degrees, it'll, it'll modulate and shut the gas valve down. It'll, it'll, uh, it'll, uh, the, the gas valve will modulate and uh, it'll, it'll shut down the gas and it'll balance it at 60 degrees. Um, when these are cold, when your boiler's cold, these should be registering at uh, 12 to 13,000 ohms. Um, ohms is a setting of resistance and this is my uh, multimeter and it's a auto, it's a good, it's a fluke 144 and it's an auto ranging one so with uh, some of the cheaper models you have to you have to set your ohms to two, either 200, 2000, 20,000 but with this one with an auto race, uh, auto ranging you don't have to bother about that, it does it all for you, it, it, it senses it itself now on these um, thermistors you've got two prongs um, there, I don't know if you can see them right well, but they're they're all the same. They're just different different makes of boilers, a different uh, a different styles of thermistors, but they're all the same principle. They're all the same principle. Um, but uh, I'll just show you how to test it. So you have your multimeter set at ohms, and that's showing open line. That's uh, that's there's no connection. If I put these two together showing it's, that's just the resistance in the cables if you can get a good connection just one minute there we go that's just the resistance in these leads so I'll uh, I might just be a bit clumsy with this but I'll just connect it on one onto one one lead onto one prong and one lead onto another and what we're showing 11 just just under 11,000 so that's a good one you're looking at 11 to 13,000 ohms at room temperature um, so that's a good one um, we'll test this one this is the same one but that I took out but I took this out of a um, another boiler and we'll test this one and that's showing 9,000 um, so that would be if that was plugged into the boiler now, that'd be registering at about 80 degrees, and obviously it's not 80 degrees because I've got it in my hand. So 9,000 uh, and an open light. It's just it's a faulty one. Sometimes it says nine, sometimes it's open loop. So that we can safely say that that one is faulty. So that go in the bin. Um, but they're all the same, all, like I said, this is the same, the, they've got two prongs, it's just a different uh, connection for a different boiler, different brands. But uh, they're all basically the same principle, they have to be between uh, 11 and 13, around around 12,000 ohms, and they'll be good. Um, but uh, yeah, that's uh, that's how to, fit, how to uh, test boiler thermistors or temperature sensors. Thank you.